PlayStation still hunting. Y'all like that? So, um, what this is, what's going on here is PlayStation, as you guys may know, have been scooping them up. The uh, they got Blue Point yesterday, uh, which was the um, developer of Demon Souls and God of War collection and some different uh, Nathan Drake collection. They uh, they've been doing some really good stuff, and Demon Souls alone was great. But the fact that um, PlayStation Studios liked them so much, they scooped them up. So um, everyone was wondering, what does this mean? Because they've you know they've gotten Housemark, they've gotten uh, Blue Point, they got Fire Sprite, I believe is their name. They're just scooping them all up recently. So when does it stop? And uh, Herman Holst, the old uh, PlayStation Studios head honcho over there, he actually indicates that the recent spending spree might not be over. Now, uh, background is PlayStation has 16 internal teams, and um, like I said, he says they're not stopping anytime soon. He says, quote, we're open always to building new relationships or bringing people in-house, but only if we adhere to the quality-first mentality and the right kind of innovation, con innovative content, new experiences, and diverse experiences. Because all of these teams, they share a lot, but they're also very different from one another. And that's what I really like. I like that's what the PlayStation audience and the fans and everyone deserves. It's the diverse slate of games coming out of PlayStation Studios. We're not just buying teams to get bigger. We're only buying teams because we feel that together we're going to make something that's going to be even better than if we did it separate. Now, like I said the other day, Herman Hulse can speak, man. He is a freaking master of the words. He can make anything sound good. So that's just a pretty way of saying, hey, we're always looking for new developers if they make super high-quality content that we've come to know and love from PlayStation Studios, right? And that's awesome to hear from, from my side. I, I, I do love PlayStation a lot, and PlayStation Studios, in my opinion, has been absolutely killing it in the recent years, right? So... If PlayStation Studios can keep doing their thing and, and acquiring these studios that actually make sense and can bring a high-value add, sure, um, I don't have a problem with it. Now, I've seen some people saying, like, God, when does it stop? Like, when are they going to let people just develop their own thing? Um, I don't know where it stops, to be honest, because you've got Xbox doing their thing, and now you've got PlayStation still scooping people up. But, but... If they can keep that high quality up for me personally, that's amazing. And um, Blue Point alone has done a great job. Like that Demon Souls game looks amazing. And uh, Joseph Redden says, "New Shadow of the Colossus from Blue Point." Um, I, from yesterday's show, uh, I believe they said their their next game is going to be fresh. It's going to be a new game that they're developing. So um, I don't know if that means like new as in a new Shadow of Colossus. What I took it to mean is a new IP. Uh, but we'll see what they can do over there. All in all, PlayStation's still going to be looking and grabbing people, so don't be surprised if we uh, are talking about another studio they pick up. What do you guys think? Are you sick of them picking people up? Do you care at all? Let me know in the comments.